Carousel Players is celebrating their 44th season with the world premiere of the play, Hana Hashimoto, Sixth Violin. It's a story of a young girl named Hana Hashimoto, Sixth Violin, and her desire to play violin, just like her grandfather, Oji-chan, um, that's how you translate it in Japanese, who lives in Kyoto, Japan, and he was once a great violinist in the Kyoto Symphony. So if she wants to play like him, she signs up for a talent show with a week to prepare. She's had three lessons, and so her brother is hesitant on whether she can do that, same with her mother, and yet Hannah presses on um, to perform. How does music play into it? Well, music is one of the major themes in the play. We have a live violinist in the show. She plays everything from Bach to Mozart to Mendelssohn um, to Japanese traditional children's songs. The music is really important because it's about how music exists all around us, how we can open ourselves up to the world, how we listen, and how in the everyday world, not just in how someone plays an instrument, but how the wind has music, how frogs sing, um, how the rain sounds, that is music. So my character is Hannah Hashimoto, and she's a girl who's going through a lot of things. She's just finding out that her grandpa might be sick and that he's away in Kyoto, and she wants to just be near him. So it's just figuring out a lot of the family stuff that's happening right now. What's the favorite thing about your character? That she's so loving and she's so spunky. She's always willing to keep trying, and she doesn't give up, and I think that's great. I play uh, Kenji, the older brother, excuse me, of Hannah, and uh, Oji-chan, uh, which in Japanese means grand grandpa or grandfather, and so he's the grandfather of Hannah. What's um, the young one like? He's uh, full of energy, and he loves soccer, and uh, he's he's troubled, um, uh, especially the, the way we've sort of developed the character for this show. Um, he's kind of got this, this darkness about him that um, slowly kind of gets unraveled as the play okay, moves along. Mm -hmm. Catherine, like you play the mother of these um, two uh, teenagers. What's that like? Today. It's a lot of listening. Uh, something I'm learning a little bit about motherhood um, through this character is that you really have to listen um, and and really try and like read between the lines of what your I children are saying. So I feel okay. like um, okay. that's the biggest challenge well, um, yes. playing playing the mother Come in on. this show. Let's talk about the author of well, the book. Tell me more about her. The author of this book is Chiri Uegaki, and the illustrator is Chin Lang, and their publisher is Kids Can Press. And Chiri um, resides in Vancouver um, with her two dogs and her husband, and she and her publisher gave me the rights to adapt this book. She is a wonderful woman. She's been out once to workshop this book. Um, this book with me, uh, adapting it to the stage. She's helped me with um, some of the Japanese translation where I've written it and then she's um, helped me make it exactly what I want it to be and she's been a great supporter and she's actually flying out here with her whole family with one of the people that this book is based on to come see it at the First Performing Arts Centre so it's, um, it's been a great relationship with her. Hannah Hashimoto Sixth Violin can be seen on April 15th and 16th at Robertson Theatre before touring schools in southern Ontario. In St. Catharines, I'm Brenda Schultz reporting for The Source.